down. Talk some high school football <laughs> tonight. Big game. Knoxville Catholic getting ready to take on Brentwood Academy out of Nashville. Yes, the game, a feature on ESPN2 tonight. Yeah, we continue our team coverage right now. Sports Director Marshall Hughes, big night tonight for the Irish today, Marshall. Yep, big night, Bo, for sure. We've talked to the players. We've talked to the commentators from the broadcast booth. It's time to talk to the head coach of Catholic High School. This is Steve Matthews. And how excited are you to put this program in the spotlight tonight? The national spotlight on ESPN. That's got to be awesome. Yeah, we're extremely excited about it. I told our players about a about a, maybe a month and a half ago, and they literally erupted in the locker room. They were, they were very excited. And, and it, as a coach, you're proud of, of where the program has come from. Uh, you know, this is my, really, I've been in six and a half years, and, and to know now we're on ESPN2 uh, playing an outstanding opponent. Uh, so we're really going to have to play well to put on a show. But, uh, you know, it, it is. It makes you feel proud and uh, where the program is and also where it's headed. Yep, Brentwood Academy, also a, a solid team. It would be a whole nother story, though, if this game was at Brentwood. What's it like to have it at home on ESPN? It's huge. We, our, our student body here and, and, and this community here at Catholic is, is tremendous. And the, have the ability to show that off uh, to the entire nation is something we're, we're, we're fortunate but also very, very excited about. I won't take up, I won't ask you for too many of your, your, your secrets here, but you've known about this game for a while. Is there anything in the game plan tonight that you've been saving to show to the national audience? <laughs> not really. You know, it's tempting. But, uh, yeah, not really. We're, we're, we're just trying to get our guys prepared. Yeah. We're still developing uh, as a football team. I, I believe we're really close to being good. Yeah. Uh, and, and I hopefully it'll show up tonight. But you can tell in practices we, we're making progress. And so hopefully we'll continue in that path. Awesome. All right. Catholic against Brentwood Academy tonight. Steve Matthews, thanks for the time. We'll send thanks back to you. <laughs> All right, Marshall, thank you so much. And you know, it's not just the students who are excited. School leaders oh, yeah. are pretty pumped up for the big game, too. Matter of fact, the bishop canceling classes for the game. Our own Kristen Farley right now out at the stadium as well, getting us up to date with all the latest. Hey, Kristen. Hey guys, it's been so much fun down here. I've been spending the last few minutes here talking with Bishop Richard Sticka and you canceled classes for the entire diocese tomorrow to encourage more students to be here tonight. No, <clears throat> no, I canceled it for the high school. Oh, just for the high school? Yeah. See, if I dish them out all at one time, I'm not, like, beloved. Mm. But if I can do it one at a time, they beloved me all through the year. Oh. Mm -hmm. I do think some of the other kids might not be at school, though, tomorrow either. That's all right. That's all right? <laughs> That's part of being a kid. Okay, so if people don't follow you on social media, I think they might start believing in miracles if I tell them this story because you had an opportunity to be somewhere else tonight and you're not there. Well, if you wonder, I'm from St. Louis, okay? Somebody asked me if I wanted two tickets to the game tonight. From, uh, they're from St. Louis. And I thought for about half a second and I said, no, I can't. <laughs> That's all right. They'll win anyway. We're getting you updates, though. Yeah, I already got them. They're losing one and nothing in the third inning. Unfortunately. We'll stay on top of that for you, though. What is it like, though, to watch this happen for so many of these kids that you have been with for the last several years here, going through schools here in Knoxville, now watching them on the field and getting this national exposure? Well, I've been here 10 years, so a lot of these kids I've known a majority of their life. And I can still recognize faces, like from second grade or third grade, but now they're 6'4 and 300 pounds. And so sometimes I have to say, now, who are you again? But I think they enjoy me. Uh, I try to get all the games and stand behind the bench, make sure that they have good language and they pray. <laughs> You'll be out here cheering tonight. I know you will. Yeah. I got a question for you. Oh, sure. Are you a Braves fan? I can't answer this on Braves the air. Fan? Your bishop is asking you this oh. question. Um, you know, I, I am getting in trouble by my producer, so I have to go. I was bailed go. out. <laughs> we're going to send it back into the studio. Good, good answer, we're, Kristen. We're praying for you both. <laughs> Kristen, right. thank you.